Oh, Cancer Sun, Libra Moons. Welcome to your 2024 Sun Moon reading. If it resonates, consider a personal pre recorded or live reading. Just click on the link tree below to contact me or text me at 646 902 5715. When you see this, is when you are meant to view it. It doesn't matter the time of year. Also, check out your 2023 Sun Moon readings and see if they rang true for you or somebody else. The first portion of this reading, I'll go over the traits of your Sun Moon combination. I'll pull the main cards and take a quick look at your 2024. The second portion is in the video link below where I will have a deeper interpretation of those cards with clarifiers in addition to a card of advice for 2024. So Cancer Sun, Libra Moons, trust does not come easily for you, even though your Libra Moon wants to give everyone second chances. You have many friends, but your chosen circle is few. Most of the time you keep your distance and observe people while minding your own business. However, when thrust into a social situation, you can be quite comfortable and are well liked by others. Nurturing, compassionate, and caring, those who are closest to you know how much you care without a doubt. Only people who are loyal and stable can win over your suspicious and wary heart. There is a duality in your nature where one side uses emotions as its map and the other facts, logic, and reason. It doesn't stop there as there is a battle between introversion and extroversion, freedom, independence, and finally judgmental and fairness. If you can find a delicate balance between the two, you will be at more peace and harmony. So Holy Spirit, Angels, Divine God's Universe, can you please read your truth, your wisdom, your clarity, your insight for Cancer Sun, Libra Moons for the year 2024. What do you see? What do they need to know to reach your higher ground become closer to universe and closer to divine january february march we have the seven of cups in the reversed finally look me up on facebook instagram tiktok like share subscribe donate refer a friend in support of my efforts that's always greatly appreciated we have the king of cups in the reversed for um april may june what do you see for july august september we have the eight of cups in the upright Okay, and how about October, November, December? What do you see for October, November, December? Okay, the Knight of Wands are reversed. Good for you. Okay, so I feel as though in January, February, March, um, what's going on is that there's somebody who is definitely drawing you in. I think they're making themselves appear in a way that's very appealing to you and um, tempting you. And you guys uh, could have a tendency to kind of idealize that situation, rom romanticize that situation. They're very good at what they're, what they're doing, okay? It doesn't have to necessarily be a romantic love interest. So, so I, although I feel it may be, it could just be someone uh, presenting a job to you and then really kind of fluffing up the job description to kind of, you know, put stars in your eyes, so to speak. So I do feel like this person is definitely kind of drawing you in. Um, and I think you go for it in January, February, March. Uh, the problem is, I think in April, May, and June, you find out what you got into. I feel as though this person turns into a very different person. Um, I think you find out that they're very unpredictable. You don't know what to expect on the day-to-day. -day. They can blow up for no reason. They may be an alcoholic. They may like their substances. Um, they could be somebody who d ruins people's lives or <laughs> ruins things and then blames other people for it. It's never, never their fault. No accountability whatsoever. But the most important thing is that they're incapable of keeping their emotions in check and their negative emotions. So negative emotions are driving their bus, which is going to cause negative outcomes. So, I mean, this, this is a terrible person, um, I feel. And, uh, yeah, so I feel like you might find that out in uh, April, May, June, but in July, August, September, you are done with this person. You stack up those cups and you walk away um, because you're saying to yourself, I deserve better than this. And I think you move on from this person and they can't believe it. Um, I mean, either you're going to look for a better job because you deserve to be treated better. You're going to look for a better relationship because you deserve to be treated better. Or you're just just leaving because you don't need to put up with any of it. So like I said, really good for you to have the wherewithal, you know, when it comes to here to leave. Um now, what's interesting, uh, October, November, December, this person does not like that. Um, they're usually used to being in control. They're usually used to being able to manipulate a situation from how they act and how their emotions are. So in this case, they're literally, I'm thinking of um, the little guy in Rumpelstiltskin. Well, Rumpelstiltskin was a little guy, right? And how like he didn't get his way and he just started like 
like jumping up and down so hard he went literally went through the floor that's kind of the vision i'm getting this person wanted a certain outcome it didn't happen you're telling them no you're telling them no, thank you you're telling them you're done and that's something you guys are really good at you can when you're done with somebody that's it snip snip they're gone that's the cancerian part of you and this person cannot believe that you're saying no to them you cannot believe that they're de you're denying them attention you're denying them sex you're denying them whatever you're denying them so they're going to get really chaotic and demonstrative um because they're not used to people doing that so good for you for sticking up for yourself so that's what i have for you all if it does resonate consider a personal pre-recorded or a live reading just click on the link tree below to contact me or text me at 646-902-5715 otherwise make sure you click on the video link below i'll be pulling these cards on those cards for a deeper interpretation in addition to a card of advice for 2024 also check out your 2023 sun moon readings and see if they rank true for you or somebody else and then finally look me up on facebook instagram tiktok like share subscribe donate refer a friend in support of my efforts always greatly appreciated otherwise cancer sun libra moons i will see you in the vimeo and adios from veronica garnett bye